And we are back. Hopefully, shutting down the stream like that doesn't screw anything up. Um, but the door is open now, so it'll be a lot colder in here. Um, which is going to be nice, because I've been sweating. I, I also put a different back pillow, so we'll see how that goes. This new Dreamcast power supply thing, the power board, I'm really digging it. Like, usually when I do these runs, the Dreamcast gets mighty warm. And just now swapping the discs out, it was nice and cool. Oh, thanks for following. Like, I've never had the Dreamcast that cold before. The last couple nights, having it go crazy like that, um, the fan, like I, I did a fan mod on this a couple years ago or a year ago. Uh, nice DeLorean. Um, and that, uh, the fan was just going fucking crazy the last couple nights. Uh, just playing so much of this. And, uh, yeah. Now it's all nice and quiet again. Just hear the sounds of the disc being red, which I've done what I can. I have cleaned the rails, cleaned the gears, and put lithium grease on everything. Best I can do. And I don't want to do the uh, uh, GC emu or GD emu uh, mod. I like collecting real discs, and as long as my laser works, we're good. I got no reason to do that. With so many GD-ROM drives dead these days, it's kind of a sin to replace a good one with uh, the SD card reader. <laughs> like, how dare you? You killed a perfectly good Dreamcast for that. But I repair a lot of this stuff all the time, so... Oh, I forgot to skip it. Um, so I'm used to it. I have no idea what the lag is like between me and the chat. I know me and the game are like a second off, but... And... Running. Come on, move! And I'm gonna grab that real quick. Yeah, sitting up with this pillow makes for a different camera angle. <laughs> Ugh, whatever. This time, I will not forget the lighter. <laughs> but I might forget to press the, the action button. Because I'm looking at the chat instead of at the TV. Oh, hey guys. Sorry. Do it real quick. And, oh, I didn't get into my spinner in the corner. Go ahead and put out that hecka chopper. And grab the key card. See, I remember some things. <laughs> like, there are some things that are the same regardless of the same, of which character. Like, A and B will always have the same whatever. I should probably grab some of that. Um, no! <laughs> reset. <laughs> Fucking reset. <laughs> How are the volumes, by the way? Like, I, I'm trying to talk quiet to not disturb the people sleeping around me, but am I too quiet? Is the game too loud? Is the game too quiet? 
let me know in the comments. <laughs> Hit that bell icon. <laughs> Come on, dumb bitch. <laughs> I'm the dumb bitch. <laughs> I'm controlling this dumb bitch. So it's all my fault. The shorts are really cool though. I'm not gonna lie, I would totally cosplay this bitch. I work at a game store, and uh, for Halloween last year, I really wanted the remake Claire's jacket. Like, I fucking love that jacket, dude. But I can never spare the hundred dollars for it on eBay. And even then, like, will it fit right? Like, what am I doing? This way. Um, But I would totally love to do that. Next time I will have money. I'm gonna do Halloween right this year. We get an extra hour because it's daylight savings and uh, it's supposed to be like a harvest moon or something. I don't know but like yeah. I miss Halloween. I used to do haunted houses. Now I just sit around playing Luigi's Mansion or Resident Evil. <laughs> nice. My husband would be way too embarrassed to do anything like that. So I'd never get to do a group thing. Unless I had friends who'd do it too. I've never done a cosplay stuff. I'm, always, I'm, I'm poor. I'm dirt poor. Like, because I keep buying video games. But... My body. Nope. I know it gives me a little extra cutscene for popping them here, but... It's easier than get taken the hit. There's also less encounters uh, with him than doing Lee on B. You don't run into him in the hallway where you meet Sherry when you're playing as Leon. And there's one uh, right at the end, right before the final like cutscene thing. Hey, it despawned the liquor. It probably would have despawned both. I think it does. Because we have to be able to hear that scream without getting hurt. If anyone comes out of the window here, but I'm just here for a peek on. Oh yeah, people love that kind of stuff. I do too. The best cosplays like are, are things like that, like really buff Misties or something. <laughs> yeah, I've seen I've seen like bros like all posing and stuff wearing seifuku. <laughs> I'm gonna dump off that valve. <laughs> Yeah, I can't wait for that new power cord. And I hope it cuts, gets rid of that signal noise there. But, oh my god, the Dreamcast is between that and buffing the discs today. My Dreamcast is doing pretty nice. The games are... Well, we unloaded faster. Um... Hopefully Claire loads faster. Claire's disc was more scratched. Like, they both still played just fine, but there was just the occasional loading issue, for sure.
gonna go kill Brad. Gotta have that costume. Quiet Dreamcast with better power supply. Oh man, this is nice. Just gotta get rid of that signal interference. And grab the key off of the wire. It's a shame I can't run the GameCube through the OSSC. I could if I buy the component cables, but I don't want to do that. I have an HDMI plug for it, um, but seeing how good this looks in a combination of the OSSC's uh, scan lines and the M Classic, um, GameCube might look pretty damn good. I blasted through. Uh... No, I I'll go this way. Um, I blasted through Metro Prime. Uh, I did that a couple weeks ago, and it was with the M class. It looked really good, but it's definitely, you know, not a hundred percent. But I mean, it was better. Hey, buddy. That's right. This run, I definitely need to get the unicorn medallion. So I'll do that. I have the unicorn medallion. Gonna give me a key so I can get the lighter. Hopefully I won't have to do backtracks like I did last night because I was real dumb. The HDMI thing do does have a scanline generator, but it doesn't look as good. Like it's too thick. It's not natural looking like, like the OSSEs. I usually use this as like a default when playing 64, PlayStation, or PS2. Um, usually not for Dreamcast though, but from now on I think I might. It depends on the game. It always depends like per game. Every game is different. So now I'm gonna whip around, grab a couple of red crystals. And level two, what up? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I fucking love this game. Pop, just cause. Pop, cause I need to. Actually, I can run pie in. I've done it before. I think I might switch back to the other pillows. <laughs> This one's a little too thick. It'd be better for sitting upright once I have a proper uh, camera solution. But I need my lighter. Because last night I forgot to grab it. And I had an issue because of that. There. Now the laptop won't fall. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh yeah, thanks for coming by. It was awesome. Oh yeah, it's been... Shit's been crazy lately. But yeah, thanks for coming by. Like, my chats are boring without people. Or my streams are boring without people talking. Or to talk to. So thank you for the follow. Um, I am gonna try to stream a bit more often. I have a bad habit about it, so pay attention to emails. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for sticking around. My um, All of my streams end up on my YouTube, which is the same as this. It's just Clark Fox. Um, yeah, it was nice talking to you. It was nice meeting you. Adios.
the sound effect when the other one falls always makes me think of like a broken plate or something. <laughs> like this one, not so much, but the other one definitely sounds like, like, oh shit, you're gonna get in trouble. Something broke. <laughs> it's shattered. Oh, I forgot to pop this guy. Probably could have ran right behind him, because he didn't seem to care that I touched him. I even pushed him a little. Oh! The fucking key! I have to come back here anyway. Whatever. One of my most hated puzzles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, a three. Seriously, it sounds like a broken plate or something. Like a coffee mug. So for my two current viewers, how are you guys doing? I'll stop it. Leon! It's good to see you're still among the living. <laughs> for now. No. No. Why is he green? He wasn't green before. Why is he green? There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. What the oh look for any survivors. The texture's got an issue. So maybe one last thing. Here's a ring. Mm. Take it. Damn. Keep in touch if anything happens. I guess that means I need to buff the disc again. Dreamcast is... Oh, god damn it. Buffing Dreamcast games is so hit and miss. Like, it scares me. If you go too far, it just plain won't work anymore. But his textures ain't loading properly. That's a shame. Wasn't doing that before. Help me. <laughs> you are safe. Like last time, you have to trigger him first. Best way to trigger cops to say something that I don't want to say on the stream because someone might take it wrong. <laughs> I don't want to get my YouTube account banned. <laughs> Mm. 
Sambos. I never would have seen this coming. Oh. Damn, the key. My inventory's full. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I feel so stupid. See, I screw something up. So I'll never get a world record. Let's screw something up. The game so depends on optimization. I'll flash it up. All the time. But I got 114 on Leon, so we'll see what I get this time. No, 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 stop it. I guess I could have put the lighter away. Oh well. I'll do that later. Actually, no. Just hold on to it. Where do I get? The diamond key. I mean, there should be Iron's office, but I can't get in there. So I'm on the C4 and I can't get in there because I can't get in the evidence room. So where is it? Wait. I fucking have it. God damn it. See, this is why I'm never going to have a good run for Claire B, because I always mix it up. Something always gets fudged up. One of these days, I'll be good at this route. I'm only really good at the other one. I need to play that one too to refresh my- but maybe that's the problem so I'm so used to that one I keep confusing myself I don't know I didn't pay attention to which key I got in Star's office because I just plain didn't care My leg is broken. So if my two stu- ah, if my two viewers are still there, how are you guys doing? What is up? I like how there's ashtrays all over the police station. It's definitely 1998. <laughs> Hmm. 
Okay, this time I'm gonna remember, grab the costume. Good boy. Hey. Yeah, I, I haven't gotten very far. Um, I, I just can't handle the anxiety. Like, I have to play that game in a very certain mindset, you know? So I haven't, I haven't beat it yet. Like, just got to the sewer last I played. I haven't even met Annette. Oh, no, I did meet her, but just for a second she was like, Don't you come near my daughter, blah blah blah. I was like, okay, fine, bitch, whatever. I don't want it. Okay, I'm gonna dump off the thing. Like I was telling the people earlier, um, I have a really nice surround system here, and the sound effects, the foley in that game is just too damn good. Hearing Mr. X walk around the floor above you, it genuinely sounds real, and it, it just, my heart just explodes. I cannot handle it sometimes. I need to take breaks. Another part of my anxiety about that game is I'm not good at twin stick shooters. I just, I'm terrible at aiming. As we all know, this one has auto aiming. And uh, RE4 on the Wii has the awesome pointer controls. Which, like, I'm good at light gun games. But two joysticks, I do not do too well. And so I miss almost half the shots I take trying to get a headshot and I just don't do too well. So I gotta take it very slow. As a newcomer to my channel, you will quickly learn I am not that good at games. Very select fear. This happens to be one of them. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. <laughs> Some more random bullshit. Uh, no. What the fuck? Target the guy behind me, Chuck. I think I have the hard key. I don't. Where is it? Oh god. Ugh, diamond, diamond, diamond. I have the C4. God damn it, it's fucking Iron's office. See, I'm never gonna get a good time on Querby. I'm just never gonna get it. I'm not good. Oh yeah, the first time through these games freaks me out a little bit just because I don't know what to expect. Hey, fuck you. But the older games, you know, once I know what to expect and everything, it's a lot less scary than the new ones. A lot easier to deal with. Usually I don't come down here until I have the other key. But I figured since I already wasted my time coming down here instead of going to Iron's office because I'm not paying attention to what the fuck I'm doing, I might as well grab this thing now. Mm 
I know, right? Also, thanks for tuning in, Craig. Just fucking... Oops, missed a shot. Oh shit, building collapsed. We're all dead. Game over. So, Craig, how you doing? What's new? Okay, for a second there I was like, I don't have the detonator, I already combined it. It's, again, I'm not paying attention. <laughs> I must be tired. I have been yawning. I'm just gonna blast down this wall. It's okay. Nothing bad can happen. Me too. Are you cheap irons? Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I thought you were another one of those zombies. Are you cheap irons? <laughs> That's me. Just who are you? No, don't bother telling me. It makes no difference. You'll end up just like all the others. That's the mayor's daughter. I was told to look after her. <laughs> we certainly looked after her. Miserably. Just look at her. She was a true beauty. So why'd you shoot her in the gut? Nothing short of perfection. But it will soon putrefy and she will turn into a zombie within the hour like all the others. There must be some way to stop it. In a manner of speaking, there is. Either by putting a bullet through her brain, or by decapitating her completely. <gasps> so, my God. And to think, taxidermy used to be my hobby. Used to be my hobby. But no longer. <laughs> I'd really like to be alone now. The best actors in this game are him and Sherry. Just listening to them back and forth for the last week. Definitely them. Too fast and I missed the light switch because I'm stupid. God damn it, just hit the switch. Thank you. <sighs> Wait, let me go. Easy, easy there. I'm not a zombie. I'm not a zombie. <laughs> That's worthy of a hug. <laughs> Yeah, that's my name too. Good figure. 
both work at the Umbrella Chemical Plant, near the city limits. The chemical plant? Then, what are you doing here? <sighs> My mom called and told me to go to the <sighs> because it was too dangerous to stay at home. Too d -d -d dangerous. I'd say she was probably right, but it's dangerous here as well. You'd better come with me. But there's something out there. I don't know what Doesn't this kid watch Darkwing Duck? You gotta get dangerous. And it's coming after me. <laughs> Where? That's what I was telling you about. It's here. Sherry, wait. Oh god damn it, I was hoping for something else. I don't know what I was Again, I'm confusing it with, with the A scenario. Because I'm more familiar with that. Come on, tired brain. You got this. Did this yesterday like no problem. But I also wasn't being partially distracted during cutscenes by a chat room where nobody's talking. <laughs> Gone. She? She? And there's the heart key that my dumbass forgot about. Just like last night when I forgot about the lighter. At least this was a less egregious error. Plus, going out of my way to kill Brad and get the key is not exactly conducive to a good time. But I gotta have the Road Warrior outfit, it's just too fucking cool. Those flames, they make her go faster. <laughs> uh, why did I go this way? <laughs> I'm so tired. I was gonna grab the other the blue piece, but I can grab it later. But for now, we must proceed down the stairs. Oh, I wonder how the M Classic combined with scan lines makes the 64 look. Just making Running Evil 2 look fucking phenomenal. The 64 looks like ass with the M Classic, so I don't use it on that. But I do use scan lines. Ah! I forgot about you. Got here in this scenario as opposed to the other one. And pop. And pop. And pop. And a downstairs. Mar. Do I need it? Me.
Oh my gosh. Sherry, I've been looking everywhere for you. I was so worried. We gotta go now, honey, okay? If we stay here, that monster will find us. Let's go. Let's go. No, I won't. What's the matter? <laughs> Don't you trust me? Not with that tone. It's not that, Claire. It's because of my daddy. He's over there. I heard him call my name. Daddy Books. Daddy must have been there you go. by the monsters. I have to help him. Yeah, I've just been playing this on Dreamcast all week. Wait, Sherry, don't Back and forth, alone. both directions. I unlock tofu mode. But I'm not good at it. I died in the western hallway. Seeing how good this looks does kind of make me want to play some PS1 games with this setup. Because I have not since I got it all. I don't have the actual disc, I have this on the PS3. But I can't run the PS3 through the OSSC without crazy ass cabling, which I don't want to do. So I won't get the nice scan lines for that version. Don't you love it when you push a box and your hands go right through it? Come on, bitch. I don't like Sherry. She's really slow. Sometimes if I spam the action button there, um, she climbs faster. I don't get that second animation. But not every time. See, like that time I got it and I was spamming the button. This time I will dispose of the key properly. If the zombies let me. Yeah, fuck, I'm gonna have a rocket launcher. Acting ever. Claire, are you there? <laughs> Sherry, are you okay? Did you find your dad? No. Yes, I'm okay. But I couldn't find him. But I did find something else for you. Here. <gasps> it's a key. Thanks, sweetie. Now, why don't you come over here? I want you to stay with me. She could stick her head through that grate and pull Sherry up by the arm. I can't reach the ventilation hole anymore. But don't worry, I'll find I don't know, with with that stuff scattered around. I can take care of myself. And that I can think of a few ways you can get through. Wait, Sherry, come back. But Sherry, Sherry. The gameplay wants you to run off. And I'm okay with that, because I don't like you tacking along. You're slow. I'm on my way. I'm on my way, got him. Thank <laughs> you. 
What's a Doberman's favorite soda? A Pupsy. Yeah. <laughs> Bet that earned a couple unsubscribes on YouTube. <laughs> Oh wait, no, I'm going this way. My bad. Ah. <sighs> More puppies. Gross. The dog ate its head. Poor dude. Poor dude. <sighs> Grab the thing. Fine. Grab the thing. <laughs> Alright, well thanks for tuning in. And thank you for the follow. I don't stream too too often, but I want to stream more. Yeah, I'll see you next time. Thanks for hanging out. Sometimes that's a liquor here, but he was in the way, so it worked out. Mm. God, I can't wait for that fuzz to be gone. I guess I didn't need to dispose of the key this way. I could have just thrown the box when I grabbed the blue stone. Oh well. Already done. Now everybody's gone to sleep, I might get the early morning people from the East Coast. Wouldn't that be cool? I like how at the remake you can just go ahead and dump a key anywhere. Like once it's done. Give you a chance, like, for example, that key where you only actually need it for one of the three uses. Fucking lighter. Um be nice to just be able to throw it away straight from the inventory. I don't understand why they wouldn't let you do that in this game. You don't want to accidentally throw away a key item. 
because then you'd be stuck. And I don't think you can throw away anything in that in the remake until it's been used all the way. Got that little check mark. It does suck you have to go into a menu to see that though. It doesn't just prompt you like, oh, this key's useless now. Not today. I wonder if I can get through this without him hitting me this time. That'd be kind of cool. And now we go up, up, and away to our beautiful, our beautiful bell room. Oh, hey, buddy. Forgot you were there. Let's get that mixed up. Yeah, I think next time I stream I'm going to do the other one because I'm more familiar. I don't want to keep it in my mind. Oh my god. Yeah, when no one's here, it's kind of boring, but I'm doing a thing. I'm not about to give up here just because nobody's in the chat room. I just have very little to talk about. Plus, I'm trying to be quiet. the 
letter. There we go. I do kind of wonder in these quieter sections if YouTube's gonna flag it. Sorry, you're okay. I'm glad to see you're safe too. Hearing people I'm sing my name like that. Stay here it's one syllable. It's not that hard. And we got a cutscene. So it's time to stretch. I like how Irons dies in Claire B. It's so much cooler than A. I could just like shoot her and be done with this. Whatever. Tell me. If you must be ruthless, it's the agent that can turn humans into the ultimate bio weapon. Serious of a T virus in every way. Oh my god. William Burkin. And his name is Daddy Burks. Thank you for following, random new person. Rare. <laughs> this is the best. I love this so much more than in the A scenario. Like, he deserves everything he gets. Chief Irons is such a terrible, terrible character. <laughs> And there he comes. <laughs> That's so great. Reminds me of that movie, um, is it Placid Lake? Don't the, the croc or alligator or whatever? I get in the opening scene, some divers are down there or something in the lake, and one of them pulls out the other one, and it's just a, the top half of his torso. <laughs> I don't like scary movies. That one I saw on a charter bus ride. And I could barely hear anything, but it had subtitles, and just in that kind of setting made it more funny than it was scary. <laughs> and a one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and a five, and I'm gonna get hit. Uh, it's okay.
So how you doing, Delox? If we can just make it out of town. But... Don't worry, I'll protect you. I promise. But you have to make sure you don't leave my side. <laughs> we will see how long that lasts. Thanks for following, Pliskin. I've never actually seen those movies. I really want to. I think one of them is on, like, Amazon. I've heard Escape from New York is really good, but Escape from LA kind of sucks. Either way, they're like quintessential what? 80s movies I've never actually seen. Oh, I, guess, I guess they're 90s, huh? I don't know. Gotta wait for Sherry. So don't leave her behind. But yeah, thank you for the follow, Pliskin. How you doing? Go ahead and say hi in the chat room somewhere there. I'll delete my side thing. Well, for ya. Damn. My wireless headphones tend to cut out sometimes, so I don't know if that's them, but that definitely had a hiccup. Yeah, hell yeah. Dreamcast represent. Love the Dreamcast. Uh, do I have the bell? Let's see. Yeah, nobody plays on Dreamcast. And I've been playing it for like a week now. A friend of mine was telling me my times weren't terrible, so figured I'd stream it, have a record of it. I, I ran into this woman who was in trouble. I'm not teased to Leon A. And Claire B. though, so I yeah. fucked up a couple things. Right after that, someone tried to <sighs> I'm just really disappointed by this disc really too. I'm afraid to buff it again. Ada went after the sniper, but I, I'm worried about her. I gotta find her before. Or something happens. But you've been shot. I'll be okay. I buffed it last night and because it was really scratched, but it was working just fine. Now I've got a couple of gla uh, gra graphical errors. 
on Leon's costume there and Cherry just now getting sucked into the sewer. So there is work to be done. I just hope I don't ruin the disc and have to buy another replacement. I bought these separately to save a little money. Just print my own case. Oh yeah, I totally agree. I've played this on PlayStation a fair few times. I think this version is better. I do apologize for that, that fuzz going up the screen. It's from my power supply. Uh, I have a new one on the way there. Are you all right? I replaced happened? the internal power supply with the Pico one, and the adapter that I got is just a piece of crap. No so I bought another one that's supposed to be good. No I won't be here for a couple days. How did you? We don't have time for that. Sherry is lost somewhere in the sewer system. Oh I have no! To find her. What? I told her to go to the police building. Why is she here? Nobody calls it police building. Now Sherry and the Keys Ample are both in danger. Oh. And she's dead. <laughs> what did she mean by that? Part of the reason I'm playing with audio, I'm usually listening to music or something. I thought I was poisoned. Oh, I guess it was just caution. Um, it's because I bought the discs and I want to make sure the audio still works and now I've had issues. I'm scared. I'm so scared to buff it again. Same thing happened with Star Wars Pod Racer. Like I killed two copies of that on that buffer, and the third one had a graphical error like this, where textures were flickering green, and I was just like, you know what? Fuck it. I don't want to spend more money on this game. And this is an expensive game too. That's why I'm playing it, just to test it. Next time I stream it will definitely be the other way around. But I might buff it again tomorrow. I don't know. Tuesday at the latest, that's when I go back to work. Climb the stupid thing. Thank you. How you doing? Thank you for tuning in. Yep. Last night playing on my own. Um, I decided to do it legit because I've been using the rocket launcher to unlock tofu mode. 
but I did it the other way around. Um, Leone, Claire B, legit, just to get the everything unlocked and to have any rank, just to say I, I did. <laughs> and that was interesting. Because I'd gotten so used to just having this one hit kill machine. So this is my first time doing the run. Both discs with the rocket launcher, that direction. And I'm testing the disc out. I'm finding texture errors, which is not good. Yeah, I just I usually play it Claire A Leon B. Um, so I'm just not used to this way around. I I got to the um, the final fight here at the end um, with Mr. X, and I had two mixed health and another green herb, and I for the life of me I could not pick up the rocket launcher, like he just kept hitting me as I crouched down to get it, and like I got to the point where I was like blinking caution. Like when it was orange, and I was like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Like that would have been a run killer there because I don't, I don't see when I'm doing these runs. So I was scared. I just had really bad luck. Sherry. Sherry, you're okay. You're okay. Hey, did your mom give you something called G virus? Either a vial or a test tube? G virus? I've never heard of anything like that before. Are you absolutely sure? If you give it to me, I'll hold on to it for safekeeping. But I really don't have anything. It's the truth. But why would your mom say something like that? I got a way for him. There we go. Hell yeah. Is it in the stream title? I don't remember if I put it in, in the title or not. Or if you saw the controller when I leaned forward to take a drink. Or maybe it's the costume. I don't know if this costume's in the PlayStation version. It certainly would make sense if it wasn't because it is higher poly than the base model. Come on, Shari. Oh. Yeah, see, I, I made that title fucking three hours ago. I don't remember. Tired. My mind is on G virus. Nice. Sometimes I don't get the triple kill. Wait here. I'm going to check it out by myself. Okay. I'll wait here, but hurry back. Oh, that's a shame. I have I work at a game store and we have a broken one that has the same issue and I'm not sure what to do with it. I've done a lot of tweaking and repairing of Dreamcasts, but that one eludes me still. My next best guess is to recap the whole board. Um but I don't know what caps it needs. I'd have to take a look. And it's a lot of work. And I'm not usually allowed a budget for things like that. 
just ordering capacitors. I usually have to argue to get stuff I need like that, like cleaning supplies or solder supplies. Ah, damn it. I was trying to grab the key. This never fucking happens. I thought you had you could only look at the monitor if you go the other side. Damn it. That is horrible luck. <sighs> but hey, now I can pop him here. Instead of around the corner. Oh yeah, uh, two and three, and the original version of Code Veronica, but everybody knows that. There was a huge marketing campaign about its release on Dreamcast. There's even a special edition one in Japan, which is really cool, but it's like $2,000 these days. It's insane. But it's like a, a blood red and it has a like gunmetal colored VMU. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's insane. That's for like a complete in-box one, though. Okay, Shin. Let's go. Yeah, one of those things I will never own. <laughs> yep. I mean, I got a lot of game shit. I got a lot of collector's edition, but I don't got no, no collector's edition Dreamcast console. <laughs> of which there's like a dozen. Thanks for following. I skipped it that time. Yes! What was that? I try to spam the start button to skip the CGI cutscenes. I, I usually don't catch that one. <laughs> Let me go kill your dad. I'll be right back. And this is the version of this cutscene where he evolves into a Machamp. Come at me, bra. It's totally what that pose is. Oh, yeah, it's three in this one. That's me. Where'd you get this jacket? You're wearing a tube top, and you're still wearing your leather vest. Oh, RE3 is awesome. I bought it, um, probably back in December. Uh, Dreamcast version. And, uh, I was playing that one back and forth, like, thinking about streaming it. I was really enjoying that game. Um, but then I finally got my coveted Dreamcast RE2, which I've been wanting for years. So I've just been playing this all week. I know, it's so awesome, it becomes great. <laughs> totally right. And then, so I bought the disc separately because this game's really expensive, complete. Especially right now with COVID making all the eBay game prices go insane. 
and I have a disk buffer at work, so I took it to work today, and uh, I don't work until Tuesday. Okay, I did manage to skip that, but then I went into the pause menu, ruined it. Um, but yeah, there's still some texture issues, like when uh, before you jumped into the chat here, uh, when Sherry got sucked into the sewer and with Leon's costume. Which is a shame, because I wasn't having those before I buffed it. And I'm really scared to do it again. And that's why I'm playing it right now, is to test it. it. It's literally what it sounds like. It's a thing that buffs scratches out of discs. It's just a soft pad with a, a special type of polish. And it just goes rrr on the disc and, and gets the scratches out. We use it at work to save games. And I used it on here to clean it up and yeah, it it tends to kill Dreamcast and GameCube if I go too long. So I'm really afraid to keep trying on this. Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of them out there. The one we have at work is kind of a shittier one. Um, it's the Easy Pro or JFJ Easy Pro, uh, which is kind of on the lower end of professional uh, buffers. It's like 160, 180 dollars, something like that. I mean, it works to save 70 percent of the games, but it will totally destroy some others. It's always heartbreaking when you lose an expensive game. Uh, there are better ones out there though, but like the best ones on the market are like two grand plus. I know one person with one. And I keep meaning to ask him if I can just like, you know, here's $30, I'm going to send you a stack. But <laughs> uh, he lives in uh, Portland. Right now is not a good time to be spending money shipping stuff that we don't really need to. Oh, nice. What server? I, I have my Dreamcast set up for it. I haven't played it in a while, though. Uh, so I'm not a very high level. I'm still kind of a newish player. But I usually play on um, uh, Silver Ant. And I've had a couple of cool groups. You know, we just spend hours playing it, just running through one or two dungeons. It's a good time sink. Every Friday the group, because uh, it's a group that runs these private servers, but they also have a website with like a chat room and forum and stuff. So you can see like, hey, you guys on? You want to play? And then there's a, a Dreamcast Now, which just tells you who's online, what, they, what they're doing, which is really nice and convenient. And so there are set schedule times, like every Friday is Quake 3. I've done that quite a bit, that's really fun. Um, and you play with PC players on that too, so they tend to kill us because we all have mice. And we have to Dreamcast controllers, but it's still fun. Um, Unreal Tournament's about to come back up, so I have a copy of that just waiting. Same thing with Bomberman Online. Um, PSO is the big one, that's like the reason anybody gets into Dreamcast Online stuff. Um, what else do I play on? Oh, the pool. There's there's a pool game. Um, <laughs> I'm not good at Unreal Tournament. <laughs> I'm not good at those games, but I still have fun with them on occasion. Um, but yeah, there's like Sierra Real Play Pool or something like that it has online play of all things, and that's really popular in the group. There's like all these different various game modes and stuff.
and of course, like, because you can access the internet on the Dreamcast, uh, you can get DLC for the games. People have preserved it. Uh, most of the website links in the on the discs themselves reroute to the fan servers. You can like download save data or like the seasonal events in Sonic Adventure or um, uh, the, the extra levels in Rayman 2. I think there's seasonal DLC for Floygan Brothers and one of them was released like two years ago, something like that. Um, all sorts of shit. It's really neat. There's a lot for Sonic Adventure 2. Unlocks like different voice modes and stuff. I have a pretty substantial Dreamcast collection. I love this system. Oh god, I have like everything, dude. <laughs> um, I want to say that there's 263 US releases. I have like 75 of them. You know, like a third of the library. <laughs> uh, there are some like big name titles I'm still missing just because they're so expensive. But I have quite a few. One I'm really after is Ill Bleed. Can't find that affordable anywhere. I'm not about to drop $150 on a Dreamcast game. <laughs> I mean, I might for a special occasion, but I'm good. Yeah, PSO is one of the things I wanted to stream though, just because it's so unique, but I'm never on when people are on. They made it easy for me that time. Yeah, up until this week, I haven't been able to stream Dreamcast, at least not easily. Kept having problems, but I bought an M Classic and that seemed to fix the out video output just enough that the Elgato finds it now. So, she targeted the wrong one. Oh god, why are you targeting the wrong one? Thank you.
for the uh, 20th anniversary of the Dreamcast last year at the store, uh, we held a, a Dreamcast party. I let people play for free on all the consoles we had. We pulled out all the expensive games we had. I uh, brought a couple from home here. It was just a really cool time. I brought the Dream Pie and everything to let people check out Click Online. Um, just to have the novelty of playing a Dreamcast online in 2019. It was really cool. No! no. <laughs> the samples inside the pendant Cherry's wearing. Oh, and I brought Typing of the Dead, too. I have two Dreamcast keyboards. One of them Japanese, one American. My American one doesn't work. I found out that day. I don't know what happened. I don't know why. I can't figure it out. Um, I haven't cracked open a keyboard before, but I'm kind of curious if I could replace the capacitors on it and it would work, because the connection seems fine. Like There's nothing seemingly wrong with the cable, or the port, or the connector. Clean that. I cleaned all that stuff. Uh, nice. Yeah, the Japanese one is fine, but uh, for typing the dead, some of the accent keys are, are different than what's printed, um, or than what you expect. So when you need to use an apostrophe, it ends up being like eight on the upper row instead of like, you know, to the right. It's, it can ruin a game. So I use a wireless keyboard that I've had since 2002 or three. Um, that actually, it, it, it's a wireless keyboard mouse combo. I don't know where the mouse is, but it's all in one wire, but it splits. The keyboard part is USB, the mouse part is PS2, which I don't understand. Uh, so I have to use a USB to PS2 converter and then the PS2 to Dreamcast converter to be able to use it, but it works. <laughs> That's what I use when uh, playing PSO and stuff. Got a little bit of input lag, but um, that's okay. Like, it doesn't ruin Typing the Dead. It's not that bad. I do have a, a mouse that I mean to test for Quake, but I just haven't played Quake lately. I haven't been on the forums in a while. Yeah, if it works, it's good. It's just, I'm really disappointed because of the Japanese ones like in the box and stuff. And I figured it'd be okay. It's got English characters on it. I know a keyboard. I can type. And that just totally ruined it for me. <laughs> so I never use that one. Unless I have like a two-player thing going on. Um, my husband doesn't really like to play that kind of stuff with me. He's not as good a typer as I am. Um, but if we would, then I would be using the Japanese keyboard, so I have the handicap. Come on! Just open goddamn buttons. But that wireless keyboard was like my main keyboard for many years. My hope to someday be able to fix the American keyboard, just so I don't have to deal with you know, batteries, the connection dropping, the lag, all the converter cables sticking out of port four on my Dreamcast. <laughs> no! That's not running, that's crawling. I don't have three yet, but um, I have played a, a bit of two. 
I can't play it for long sessions though, because like it's just too anxiety inducing. <laughs> like I have to set it down for weeks at a time sometimes, so I'm not very far. Like I just don't feel like going back to being a very certain mindset to do that one. The um the surround sound is just too damn good in that game. Dun dun dun. Sherry? Where are you? Sherry! Where is she? Crying over her dead mom. She's not actually dead. Come on, push the fucking button. Yeah, see, it's the same, same thing. It's like way too stressful. I'm just like, I need to back away for a minute. <laughs> I'm waiting for RE3 Make to get on sale. No, it's all good. Don't worry. Sherry, we have to go now. See so yeah, how this messed me up because this whole time I thought she was dead. But look. She's resting as though asleep. Her fever has subsided. Maybe she is dead and it's just the game trying to be nice about it. But I imagine they would like explicitly say she's not breathing or something. Because the silhouette it gives you the rocket launcher totally is Ada. Looks and sounds like Ada to me. But I'm thinking maybe it could be Ada? I don't know. But I think it's still Ada for when they do Claire B. It'd make more sense if it was a nut, though. Well, whatever. I won't see it this time, because I already have a rocket launcher. It's a train! Choo choo, motherfucker! Now you wait here, okay? I'll go and get this thing moving. All employees proceed to the 
Really? I never really noticed the green slime on those crates before. It has to be because of how I configured it this time. The game definitely looks a lot better. You hated four? Nobody hates four. Four is like the golden child of this series. Next to two. <laughs> Like, five and six are jokes for sure, but four is actually a good game. It's just not the same as, you know, this. Uh oh. Uh, what they're saying is uh, Matenlo, which means get him, kill him, and uh, uh, what's the other one? Uh, I don't know, but it's basically what they're saying. Kohetlo, that's the other one. I don't remember exactly what that means, but it's basically the same thing. There he is. Get him. Oh. You lose, big guy. It clipped through him again. That happened once before. Lose, big guy. <laughs> that was awesome. The last time that happened, I was streaming and it killed me and it was hilarious. But this time I managed to get a second shot in before he hit me. <laughs> that was great. Oh no, he did hit me. I'm hurt. That's cool. Four is a little hard for me to wrap my head around sometimes. I definitely prefer this style with the camera angles and whatnot. Honestly, the tank controls work because of these camera angles. Um, it's definitely a different experience than an action game. a good game, but it's, yeah, I can see why. Five and six suck, though. Gotta punch your boulders. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Because, I mean, that's where the fun is. That's where the action is.
No. My brother has to break me out of Prism Island. <laughs> God, his neck fucks me so hard when it bends at that angle. <laughs> What happened? What was that? Oh, now he's not green. Maybe it's only when it's zoomed in. <laughs> Warning. Biohazardous outbreak imminent. The emergency system has been activated. This train will detonate. Repeat, this train will detonate. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> I don't know. The door won't open. Oh, well, it's such like a genuine like little kitty like like meow. <laughs> Welcome back, Daddy Burks. I guess you're Daddy Blobs now. Because this Japan, the final boss has to have tentacles. It has to be a tentacle monster. That Sarlacc pit mouth fucks me up too. Even with the graphics like they are. I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> I guess it was 10. I, right? Who imagined this boss? It's crazy. Japan loves their monsters, for sure. They're really good at being creative about it. But they almost always have tentacles. <laughs> and like, transform into weird things. Game over. Warning. Warning. The self-destruct system has been activated. Each train compartment will detonate sequentially. Repeat. Each train compartment will detonate sequentially. Leon, stop the train! Yeah. The board has control room is locked. We're going off the rails on this crazy train. Doing some reckless shit. You up, do you? Sherry, what are you doing? We have to stop the train, right? I <laughs> don't run to the monster with the giant teeth. I know you want to, but don't. I like how he's like totally content to abandon sharing <laughs> by climbing underneath the train. <laughs> Whatever. Finally. Are you okay, Sherry? I'm okay. Where's Leon? Leon? Leon! 
right oh, here. Oh, Leon. You're both safe. We've got to get out of here. Move it. Go. Classic. <laughs> on that explosion. That was a close one. That was pretty impressive back there, Sherry. It was nothing. I saw someone do that on TV once. <laughs> Come on. We've got to move out. Now what's the problem? Someone pushed a button on a train once on a TV. <laughs> Well, actually, he finds you. Then you both escape together. I don't know, I haven't played Code Veronica in a fat minute. But I do know he shows up. I imagine my time was not the best on here. I screwed up a lot. I'm just not used to this scenario. Used to the other one. Messes in my head doing both of them back to back like this. A thank you. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I didn't even notice you were here. I'm sorry. <laughs> you gotta pipe up in the chat rooms, otherwise, I don't know who's here. <laughs> yes. Thank you, thank you. What's the crown mean? I don't know. R.I.P. Paul Hatted. Yeah, no, no, I can't. <laughs> I couldn't even beat Tofu Survivor. Like, there's no way. Like, I fail so hard to kill zombies with a knife. Shinji Mikami, um, right before he did Resident Evil 1, he did um, Goof Troop on the Super Nintendo. Which is another fantastic game with similar puzzle elements. <laughs> Very different tone. Ready, what two? All right, moment of truth. Moment of truth. How bad did I do? Oh, thanks for following. Well, it's going to be a B because I used the um, rocket launcher. It's the time I care about. 123. I've done better. Yeah, using any of the special weapons automatically knocks you down a grade. Uh, so if you use any of them, you're going to get a B, period. I mean, yeah, it's still pretty good, but like, I just don't know the scenario that well. I do better on the other one. But that's why I was doing this one tonight, was to practice. Oh, nice! I also, like, skip all those cutscenes if I can. <laughs> all the CG ones. Yeah, that's it. I'm tired. Stricter ranks. <coughs> well, uh, I know without using the special weapons, without using the rocket launcher, I always get A's. I figure it was just for the time. 
that I heard once years ago, I don't know if it was this game or like the remake of one, that if you use a first aid spray, it hurts your rank. Uh, so I just never use first aid sprays in any of these games, like unless I absolutely have to. But this one, there's so much health, that, like it doesn't matter. <laughs> Uh, I I don't know if it's if it hurts your rank honestly. Um, before I was doing zero save runs, um, like my first playthrough in years, um, was something like twenty saves per file, and I still got like Bs or Cs. I don't I don't know. Probably does. It probably does. Anyway. I am done. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for hanging out in the in the chat room because it keeps me going. <laughs> like the conversation is what keeps me from getting bored. So thank you. And uh, hang in there. Like you know, masks and social distance and all that fun shit. So cheers. Thank you for watching. <laughs> oh, another person. A little late there, but... <laughs> but yeah, um, since you guys missed the Leon run I did right before that, it will end up on the YouTube. Um, it's the same thing, it's just uh, YouTube slash user slash Clarfox, whatever. It's there, and you'll figure it out. Uh, you guys are just smart. You guys, you guys have been on the internet before, right? You know how the internet works? Yeah, I trust you guys. So, yeah, if you want to check that out, cool. If not, cool. Thank you for watching here, though. That was awesome. Have a good night, guys.